Hey, how's it going? Welcome to my channel. This is the Everything Channel. And um, today, we are going to go to McDonald's, McAdee's. And um, I'm going to give you my review on a cheeseburger there. Okay? So we're going to go test out their food. So we're going to get one cheeseburger. And um, yeah, and I'll let you guys know how it tastes. It's a racer! Racer, racer, Uh, can I just get a cheeseburger, please? Yeah, I'm gonna wait at the first window, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'll get back to you guys in a second. Okay, so we are waiting for our cheeseburger. Oh, our lovely cheeseburger. Okay, now we're about to get up to the window. And then we will we'll test out that fatty, cheese, juicy cheeseburger. Adios. Okay, everyone, we just got our cheeseburger. See that thing in my face? I, I saw it! I saw it! No, I'm singing. I'm sorry. I have issues, as you guys can tell. Okay. So I got I got my cheeseburger, and I'm about to eat this shit! Oh, I should not shoot it like that. But we're gonna just park, and I'm gonna... I'm gonna devour the sandwich right here. So we're gonna see how this tastes and we'll give you a nice review okay so um first of all zero on napkins and oh by the way i don't ever eat mcdonald's okay this is the first time in like a couple years so here it is i'll open up for you guys so this is just a cheeseburger like, what is that? Like, you call that a burger? Do you call this a burger? Okay, we're gonna take a bite out of it. Uh, and again, it's been a couple of years. So let's go ahead and try this. It's cold. Dry. A lot of ketchup on one side. Mm. 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 No, I'm just kidding. I wasn't joking. Mm. Really, really, really gross. I'm never going to buy one of these again. Um, this is my review. This is a fake burger. Everything about this burger is cheap. Okay? Everything. Literally everything. The buns are cheap. The meat is cheap. They're pick okay, I'll, I'll actually tell you something. I used to work at McDonald's, okay? the worst place you could work at. I remember, I remember like, I'd be like walking through the aisle. And this is, I used to work really, or I used to work mornings all the time, like four in the morning to like, like three, 4 PM. And, um, so I'd be walking through and I see this guy drop a, a, a patty, like a, um, not a patty, just buns, you know, just a bun or the biscuits, whatever. I see him drop it on the ground. He looked like this. Oh, oh. You know what I'm looking? Picks it up, puts it right back. And I'm just staring at him. I'm like, what the hell? I was like, oh my goodness. And imagine, just think about this. Uh, one of you ate it. One of you ate it. Oh man. It's. 
it's bad. It's disgusting. Um, and I've seen like when I when it's like one, two p.m. whatever. When it's lunch, I remember someone dropped the fish. I think it was the same dude too. He dropped some. He was a he was a Mexican guy, and um, he dropped a fish fillet patty on the ground. Picks it up, puts it right in the sandwich, <laughs> and I was like, and I remember I gave the food out. I mean, I should have just been like, dude, get a new one. But I, no, I, I know. I like, I should have, I should have, but I didn't. And, um, so, yeah, he, um. She took it. I gave it to her. She drove off. And then munched it up. Like it was the best fish filet sandwich. She probably got some hairs and made some dirt in there. She probably enjoyed it. But yeah, McDonald's is not a very good place to eat. If you can tell, people are fat. Like, I, I saw this video of protesters. Like, no McDonald's. No McDonald's. And they're all fat asses. But I'm like, what? You, you're going to go after you're done protesting and complaining. You're going to walk right over there and get a big ass Mac. Big Mac, bro. And you're going to eat it like you love it. Because... McDonald's, McDonald's makes you happy, you know? And then you go back outside after you're done with a Big Mac and you're like, no, McDonald's, look how fat we are because of McDonald's. But you made yourself fat. Who's the one going there? Who's the one that's like, huh, should I get a Big Mac or should I, should I buy half the store and eat it all myself and become overweight? Whose choice is that? I think it's, I think it's theirs. It's their fault for selling us this bad food. That's how people act. So, to those McDonald's lovers, I recommend buying a burger that's actually tasty that's real like you could go to like uh yeah some places they don't have it but in and out five guys burger um chick-fil-a the in and the, the thing is these are these are um these uh burger places are family owned so they're in their christian you know they're they actually put they actually put you know like actual like goodness in their food they don't just slap some crap on there and be like here you go like literally i've 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 had a big mac once and um and pretty much i got a big mac and it was more like a sloppy mac they should have called it a sloppy mac because like it was like like sideways like i didn't even know how to eat it i was like like i was just like i wasn't mad but i was disappointed i was like come on i like i don't eat mcdonald's this is a long time ago i don't eat mcdonald's i come to mcdonald's get a burger and they just don't know how to make it chick-fil-a you go there perfect meat just oh it just sits there you take it and you bite it but mcdonald's they it's like a place like yeah they call it fast food but i mean like come on i'll eat fast food i get it but may at least put some effort into making your food okay so that's all i have today uh disappointing burger i just ate i'm probably gonna like crap out a lot of bad things tonight but that's all thanks for watching the everything